and we are live. Fantastic. Welcome back to Fate. For those of you that have been watching us on the, on the stream, you've got a feel for kind of what we're doing. For those of you that are watching on YouTube, uh, we're, we're going to do a recap anyway, so that's fine. What, what happens is they have reached the battlefield of a ruined city in front of <coughs> Apple <laughs> Which is the long forgotten dwarven <laughs> fortress. Now, a couple yeah. of things have happened as you progressed closer and closer to this place because you've had a couple of days of travel in order to reach where you are now. Um, kind of divvied out who would be commanding what, etc. You have your units in play. And. As you have come closer and closer, Wolfgar, in your sleep, you have been provided through your goddess additional information that has kind of slipped through the cracks of Dwarven history, because it's, it's, this place has been abandoned for a long time. Um, hey, Gerald, project your voice a little bit. Oh. Just like the mic's not picking up where it should be. Cool. Got it. You're pretty far away. Ah. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> I'm going to wreck you guys. You're perfect now. So. <laughs> okay, good. Good, good, good. All right, I'm going to read this because I wrote it, and it's good. And it's relevant to... The problem. The problem. Yes. When the Dwarven peoples, and you would have kind of picked this up through your dreams and stuff, through Arusha, and relayed it to the Dwarven army and to your comrades, we'll say. At least some of it. I will let you, this will be at your discretion. When the Dwarven peoples were much more plentiful than they are now, there were ten main clans. Ale Mantle, Blood Anvil, Bongo Hammer, Cairn Breaker, Dark Hunter, Deep Smiter, Frostbeard, Ingot Master, Iron Fist, and Stormforged. Uh, symbols to come later. I wrote that down. <laughs> TBD. Yeah, <clears throat> to be determined, yes. The High King was the overseer of the clans. And when the High King decided to retire, died, or was replaced due to incompetency, the latter of which was pretty rare, uh, typically they would just retire because they didn't feel like doing it anymore, or they would die of old age or whatever, the council will determine the next High King based on the merit of the individual, not the bloodline. In other words, or I guess for example, if a dark hunter was high king and decided he was done with the responsibility, there was no guarantee that another dark hunter would be the next high king. As this was determined based on honorable merit, many a dwarf would become an adventurer after working in his field for a time. At any rate, the dwarven community was doing great and was exceedingly prosperous, utilizing the fiery technos deep within Arton to power their forges. We'll get to that once you're actually once we're there. Their wealth drew many eyes to them. Some were goodly folks, just wanting to do business, while others were not so much. A great many rogues attempted to penetrate the vaults of Afoshnyar. Trump. These were either caught or killed. Those who were caught were used in the mines to work off their punishment. They were treated reasonably while in service to the dwarves, and once their service had concluded, they were released if they chose, or given work if they chose to remain. So, Wolfgar. Essentially, yes. Thus, the dwarven fortresses of Afoshnyar no. became home sure. to more than just oh. dwarves. <laughs> One such individual, a fellow by the name of Aeneas, which is Amadeus, Estonian for Greek. <laughs> You'll see why in a moment. Uh, decided he wanted to stay for a very nefarious purpose. <coughs> he had gotten the furthest of any of the others, but was caught in the end. He bided his time, earning the trust of the dwarves, but in the end he betrayed them, for he was secretly the devil lord Mammon, Archduke of Greed. Mammon. He slowly turned the dwarves against each other, which is now why typically dwarves tend to stick to the clan and not the dwarf race as a whole. Good. Fuck dwarves. Oi! Mammon enhanced the greed so much that there was some internal strife, almost a full-blown civil war. When mistrust was at its peak, Mammon struck. He snuck into the vault when other dwarves had opened it to make sure that no other clans had taken the wealth <coughs> designated for their own He's clan. No. Upon arriving, oh, okay. Mammon opened a portal to the hells. My grammar failed right there. 
Jeez, what do you even use that English degree for? Shut up. And a great army of demons and devils poured out upon right. the dwarves. Or anything, <laughs> if they had fought as a cohesive unit, it would have been stopped, but the damage was already done. The dwarven community scattered and fled, taking what they could and leaving the rest to the demonic forces. Across generations of dwarves, the location of Appleshnar was forgotten. Snar. Snar. But not the losses or the memories of what still resides there. But Appleshnar has been found again, Snar. and the adventurers have been tasked to clear it out. <laughs> The first phase of this plot is to gather the army which you have to face the primary forces haunting Appleshnar. 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 It's so fun to say. It really is. If this is not achieved in the combat, well, we're not really worried about that part. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Cool. All right. We've already had all that discussion. Lovely. As you are entering the primary field, which you see on the map here, a gate opens up near you, and out comes 150 Penumbra assassins. Sweet. With the missive that they hand to Ulfgar, that essentially says, Hey guys, hope you're doing good. This is Kagan. <laughs> Send some help. Good, good luck. luck. <laughs> so we've got some help? Yeah. They have chosen, I believe all three yes, sets, all of, been assigned. Uh, sets of those have been assigned to various people. Yeah. Uh, they have chosen their army units. This is not representative of the entire army. Just because uh, yeah. that would take entirely too much time. This is the bulge. But this is where the uh, sort of center point is where you're trying to break through and get to Apple Yeah. Yeah. Really dick hole devils. <laughs> dick hole devil! Alright, now. Now that you've got some lore as far as what happened and why, uh, you... Uh, let us begin. I'd like to have a meeting with all the commanders first. Okay, please do. All right, so Sai here has drawn up a, little, a nice little battle plan. A bit crude, but <coughs> workable. Okay. So, would you like to explain? Simple, simple in theory. Always. So, here are our hills. Can we show the camera? That's what I'm sure. pointing out for. There's a camera right here. <coughs> it's a very bad, bad drawing. So we'll post more with here. So I think a good, good plan to do is so we have got our dick old devils over here. Dick old. <laughs> and and uh, I also labeled it as the good guy bastards down here. All right. Yeah. We so, are bastards. Fair. Yeah. So you could even say inglorious. What you say inglorious? Good. So. I think it's a good idea to shut down right now. Send forward a small group of fodder, of fodder, like our fodder guys, like that that can move pr pretty quickly, straight up, straight into the, into the middle. They'll try to hide behind anything, just straight up into the, into the front to get as to draw as much of it as possible. Meanwhile, have a lot of our ranged guys come up onto the hills, and just as combat is about to enter. Retreat back to the to the main force. By the main force, uh, meet them. And that way, we can get two way crossfire as well as our melee guys coming come up to drive it, drive the hammer in. So we gotta be able to pour aggro in the middle. Yeah. So I'll send my guards up to the middle, and then we need something to draw them towards us. I've got my spies going in for that. There we go. Yeah. Because we gotta be able to focus them at least towards middle and well, off no, the I hill. Mean, you send up your fodder and my fodder right behind it. And as they're getting up in the middle, we start firing pot shots. Okay. And I'm then just as soon as they're interested and start running mm. towards us, retreat. Okay. I'm gonna go in. There. You're not allowed to hear this, by the way. I don't meta game. For, I can't forget, meta game. Get everything that you've heard. He he wants us to win. He's just gonna try and kill us really hard. He's like, well, first I kill everyone on the hill. <laughs> <laughs> I do not aggro. Uh, aggro there are traps there. 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 <laughs> we do a mass detect traps. 
<laughs> I will tell you that they technically are smart enough to do traps, but they don't have any traps. Sweet. That's good news. They don't so, need to yeah. depend on traps. For simplicity purposes, and because I didn't have time to fully flesh out a battlefield, per se, there are no traps. Cool. Yay! That would just complicate the shit out of everything, and I just don't feel like messing with it. So, so plus, like, uh, what, what, what's your... In reality, a trap would not necessarily affect a whole army. Either. No, it's yeah. like three, four would people. Like Unless it was like a mustard gas bomb. Which I don't think they have. <laughs> they yes. don't have. That's very true. That's horrifying. Modern no. No. Times. <laughs> no, no. Why? Why? Oh, this is the thing. There's no Geneva Conference uh, laws in our <laughs> this, this is fair. You see one of the bailers pull out a football and just start typing in codes for launches. All right. <laughs> For each group of units that you have, I need initiative rolls. For each roll. Oh, well, each unit. What, what For, For each group. So, so, like, let's say you have a group of, like, seven warriors, right? Then that would count as one set. Right? So if we have a group of 50 for number agents, it's... That's one set. Okay. That's one one unit. No, you oh, bought 50 a bunch numbers. of units of okay. guards. So yeah. basically for each, so each, each seven rolls, for each unit. I will account for All right. it, yes. So just tell you what the raw roll is? Yes. Uh, first tell me what you have, and then what, like, kind of, we're, we're going to go around the table. Tell me what unit you're rolling for, and what the roll is. So we'll have one for, like, so I bought one set of agents, one set of, or one Music assassin, sure. yeah. two scouts, two bands, so I'll do six rolls. No, you do four. He has two separate groups of scouts. Two I know. separate groups. But for scouts. Okay. For scouts, you roll one set. Got and it. would move both scout groups. Got it. Alright, so I'm rolling for Penumbra. Okay. That didn't. <laughs> wow. That didn't make it what the hell, dude? That was <laughs> way off. <laughs> it's a 12. Okay. The first roll was better, but I'm not counting because it didn't land anywhere in the fucking tray. Cool beans. <laughs> All right, hang on. I gotta move it down here because it's gonna be a big list. Uh, this is Wolfgar. The number. Okay. Next for you. All right. That is my veteran archers. They got a nine. All right. You're failing. You're both failing. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Your veteran archers. archers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Next up is my wolf reaver dwarves. Cool. Because that just sounds fucking cool. It does, right? They got a 16, and that's Ooh. the group I'm leading, nice. personally. Uh, what is your initiative bonus? Four. Nice, so that would be 20. Yeah, I've got an 18 dex. So pretty high for a dwarf. Come on, the garbage. That is... I pumped the... a lot into decks at higher levels. Uh... And then I've got my last group, which is spies. Okay, cool. I like this. And they it's got exciting. A, they got five. They got Big five. 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 How do cool. spies? How are they not in, taking the initiative? <laughs> I'm hoping they have a, the alert feat. Like every single one of them has alert. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see what and this thing. And super high fucking decks. All right. Let's see what this thing. Sai, what you got, Sai? Hold them here, please. I'm not going to. That's why I didn't take out my. Do you want this box? Do you want me to use this one? It's got leather in it, and it'll get jacked up. <coughs> he rolling for first. My set up a number eight. That's that's my dad, we just roll on the table. That's who you're with, right? Which, which, which you were commanding? <laughs> like, are you I, with them? I am commanding this. So you yes. add your decks to it? You would add your proficiency bonus to it, because you're leaving them. Oh. Just proficiency bonus? Or your, I'm sorry, your, your, initiative? your initiative bonus. Whatever that may be. Oh, goody. That's yeah, I am. Yeah. Plus <laughs> twelve. I've got you took alert, didn't you? I definitely have alert. <laughs> so that's going to be a 24 with the added nice. initiative because I rolled a 12. So I... Which is good. Okay, cool. I'm Next group. Be, be high up there. Um, assassins. Okay. That is a 19. Nice. Very, very nice. Okay. So, All right, then I've got my group of scouts. Okay. Oh. Which is, well, it's two units. That's fine, but yeah. Scouts in general are a 10. 
Alright. And I have my bandits. Is a 13. Mm. Okay, cool. Uh, just speaking for uh, Eisen Schmidt, he would probably use Bardic Inspiration to give it to us at the beginning of this fight. That sounds about right. It sounds so like something you'll all have. Yeah, we'll say that he does that. That's fine. Yeah. Um, Gives you a big rousing speech, like what he wrote. Yeah, yeah. 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 on our Facebook. Yeah, exactly. Just, actually, that was his speech. That's his speech. It was yeah. super inspiring. I was like, "Damn, man, that's good." <laughs> so I have three groups of mages who I will be with. Okay, that's gotcha. Uh, fourteen for that part total. Yeah. Including your initiative? Yep. Okay. I don't have a huge initiative. You are Elric. Uh, and that's a group of wizards? Three Elric groups Warcock. of the mages, yeah. Mages. Uh -huh. okay. Elric Warcock. Well, there wasn't oh. wizards written on there. Was there? there is wizards. Yeah. yeah, they're towards the bottom. Oh. They're, they're expensive, though. They're like super. They're, they're oh. one of the highest ones. Like Wizard, the highest is, ones. It's, it's 1800. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I would be able to buy one. Yeah. So anyway. That's fair. I got wizard. I got one. All right, um, and then I have. Yeah. Why didn't I take that? Two I a gladiators. Wizard. Two gladiators. Okay. <laughs> Which theirs will be. Who has the other banana? Eight. 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 No, no, I didn't get it. Get I got the wizard instead. Oh, then no one. Then we only have two, because that's the number. Elric. Rainer. Oh, Rainer got one. Yeah, yeah Rainer. Rainer got, got one. one. We'll say Rainer gets one. Yeah. You somebody want to roll for that? We'll we'll get to it. Okay. And then I also got a group of spies. Okay. And they have 13. 13, cool. I like this. It's going to be a lot. Uh -huh. Dang it. That's okay. This was your idea. It, 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 that's, it was, but it's going to be great. Ah! No! <laughs> great, and you dick. Nope, nope, nope. Don't do that. You got to... Oh, get him out of the there goes, there goes all I, get him? I can't reach him now. Gerald, you have to get him. Good thing we're not playing Risk. Right? Here, I got him. I yeah, got him. get him. You're in. Ah! You're right here. I think I was there. <laughs> Killed TJ. <laughs> all right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Evander. All right, all right. Uh, so I have seven off. guards. So I just roll once for all one, seven. One for the guards, yeah. Right. Seventeen. Nice. nice. And, and then you're just a shit ton of guards. Is that all those D8s are? Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, then we'll say the cultists. Okay. Fifteen. <laughs> shit. Uh, scouts. Quit using up all your good rolls early. Under, yeah. uh, oh, that's fine. Okay, there you go. Seven. <laughs> okay. And then, scouts. Yeah, yeah, and the wizards with me. That wizard. So you got a group no. of wizards? Yeah. Like full wizards? No, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got them. Like They're 1, on a point wizard. <laughs> fucking rad. Yeah. 28. 20. 28. Yeah, it's plus. It's it, I'm plus pretty sure it's right. It's like plus 16. It's a plus 16. Yeah. yeah Damn. Zero. That's ridiculous, <laughs> dude. <laughs> and I got wizards. <laughs> he went before the penumbra. <clears throat> All of them. All right. Okay. Wizard, you want to roll for? Uh, I, I just, I just read, yeah. Wait, don't, don't you have a number or no? No, he got uh, the the oh, okay. hugging things, whatever. Yeah. Here, I'll roll for I just missed the number. Real okay. Quick. They get two. <laughs> Where's I character sheet? It's easy and it's not that good. Oh, uh, we just moved it a second ago. I'll, I'll take care of it. Good. They will have a much higher uh, initiative they, than he does. Yeah, so that's fine. Well, Ice Raid will be on Imch's back. I don't know if <laughs> the number would be with Imch. <laughs> that's Imch, a hell of a stack. I, mean, I have two armies. Yeah. <laughs> so okay. Got it. Plus four. Yeah. Uh, so that's all yours, right? Yep. So. Yep. Uh, Ring Mage. going to be a ten. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Dwarven Ring Mage. Uh. <laughs> Right. You don't have any uh, uh, big timber here, do you? I have two. Oh man. Do you want one? I do want one. Dig it. Cool. I was just like, oh, because I actually went out and filled up a drawer. Yeah. And I forgot it. Oh <laughs> shit. Mage. Yeah, I do have two. Uh, and what was the other yeah. one? Scout. Scout. So grab me okay. one of those do essays. Me too. You are now drink, bitch. 
Please. No. <laughs> I, uh, I will get drinks. Who else wants drinks then? I'm good. All right. Awesome. Yeah. And then... Gerald also wants that uh, other DUSA. Gut busters who are on me. Now, because I have advantage on initiative rolls, can I use that for this too? Did you take commoners? <coughs> yeah, you have a group of commoners. Yeah. Um, that is funny, my friend. But funny as hero. Yeah. Because I have advantage on initiative, can I use that yeah. with this roll? With your group? Yes. Yeah. How do you get advantage on initiative? He's a barbarian. Oh, awesome oh shit, barbarian. that means I do too. Uh, 13 for Gutbusters. Oh. No, he, he's a barbarian. Yeah, yeah. Shield gives yeah, yeah the Sentinel yeah. shield um, that Terrell 13. used to have. 13 for Gutbusters. Yeah. What was my... For me, <coughs> uh, What was my Wolf River Dwarves? Hey, Eli. What? Is your Koozie's at when you're done? Uh, across the room, mm -hmm. second from the bottom. What are my Wolf River Dwarves at? Mm, I nailed it. 20. 20? 20. Let me see if I can get there. Yes, I, oh, that's the same one. That's the same. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. I need to roll for my dudes because that's relevant. No, you don't. They all got ones. <laughs> this is gonna be good. I can't wait. I, I wanna. I wanna tell these guys. We. I wanna be like, man. <laughs> you guys are out there to die. I want them to understand that. <laughs> yeah, they're commoners. That's what you didn't know. You were going to die. <laughs> None of you will survive this. I am going to give a rousing speech to the army. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's so much gold in there, you won't have to worry about bills or liquor oh. or women for the rest of your lives. And, uh, and then you hear I just been say, especially liquor, especially liquor. <laughs> and dwarven women. And dwarven women. <laughs> yeah, we're bringing some of those. Oh, yeah. <laughs> or men, if that's your fancy. <laughs> Whatever, we <little> love alcohol. <laughs> Okay, good, 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 good. Mm -hmm. No, not good. I don't like that good. I think I'm gonna rub this rock like on the side so much. It's gonna like go all the way down. Can I see it? Yeah. Thank you. Seriously? All right. Really wasn't that I am ready. Not Are we ready to begin? Like I think I paid. All right. So, uh, hey Bob, so what, see those five dice like, right there? Yeah, those are mine. Uh, the D12s like are the barbarians, the 10s are zero. the other mages with me, and the D4 is the spy. Yeah. Where where do these guys need to go? Guys? Wherever you want them to go. The water yeah. goes up the middle. So yeah, the barbarians the and the spy are going up the middle with... Is that the D10s? The, no, the Twelve. D10s are the mages with me. The D12s are the barbarians, or gladiators. Right, yeah, but right there. And then that's the spies. Okay. Not, and not all the... Uh, hold back, are with hold me. back the good... I guess... Well, the good um, melee guys. Because you are one of the other group. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, put this over next to his D4. Because we want to try to draw them in and then not the, retreat no, them back. Not the D4. No, right here. Yes. Huh? Go That's ahead, all Corey. Spies. I think what we were wanting to do is like bring like the crappy fodder up, and then have them. No, this is this back. next to Sai. This is a substantial. We're about the three hundred their ass. This is a substantial. Like our force. Bring, bring them into yeah. the valley um, and now, fuck them up. Evander. Yep. Your wizards, which is you, yes. goes first. All right. Well, I can only move thirty. Actually, I can double move, right? Is a dangerous. Yeah, you can double move. <laughs> drop a metal D4. He's a cow drop. And in the again, hospital. this is fifty feet increments. So, like, oh. it's no, it's good. But we the also round two each minutes. round is two minutes. So, like, your turn is two minutes of in-game time. I see. As far as movement goes. So, you get. To move what the range is? Five? No, that's the no. range. What you is can their shoot. Movement? movement for non dwarves is going to be six squares. Because if you do the math, that's how it works out. Okay. With fifty foot squares and the movement speed. If you're a dwarf, uh, it's going to be five. Because dwarves move a little bit slower. What are these up here? They've got short legs. They're, They're pitch those are mains. Those are natural sprinters. Those are mains. They're little 
derpy, piddly like, is. Smaller than us. In real <laughs> they're, life. they're the commoner ish format of demons. Alright. I'm gonna take out my pistol. It's time. Okay, I'm gonna wait to do that. Okay, well, uh, give me just a second. Uh, Alright, so. Later! So you look. 